Hey guys, welcome to Twinkie 75 Creations here with Janet. Thank you for joining me. Well, today I'm going to be doing, um, I'm in a swap collaboration with Mandy's Place. And, um, what's all about is that, um, me and myself, Mandy, and all these other ladies, wonderful ladies, are doing a stash, you know, refill. So it's like we're building up our stashes, you know, because sometimes we just don't have like last minute time, you know, to find stuff and be able to send something like out like that, you know, because somebody needs something. So what we're going to do, we're all doing like embellishments and um, creating stuff, just being creative, you know, being crafty and just trying to get stuff out there, you know. So what we decided is that uh, for the whole month of August, and today is the first time, we're going to be doing uh, every Monday a video of all the different uh, crafts that we're creating, and all the ladies will be able to see it. Now, at the end of the month, uh, we'll be put up, partner up, and we're going to share our stashes around. So we could build from like five complete stashes. It could have two, it could have four. You know, you could do as many as you want. So you could share with everybody and have extra right there on your side. So for me, you know, I decided that the one thing that I'm really enjoying right now is rosettes and trying to build up and trying to do them. So um, this is my creation. I got two different styles of uh, of um <clears throat> doilies that i printed out out of my cricket machine i'm really enjoying it also i have this tag that's yellow but it just seems like too bright so i don't know if i'll be using that one but i got other stuff too you know so for right now what i want to do is make you know make a a stash for you guys of what i'm planning on doing of course everybody knows how to make rosettes i don't i started learning and this is the best way I started, which was kind of good because it was an exercise for my fingers. That way my hand could get like, you know, used to it. Because I get, um, I have arthritis and everything on my fingers and, and hands, so they kind of hurt. Um, but anyways, um, let's not talk about that. So uh, as you guys, I'm showing you guys, I worked on all of this. These are all white, just white, 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 white white rosettes even if you guys want plain ones and if i have some please go ahead and ask me i wouldn't mind seeing you guys some you know it's like good exercise it was so relieving everything so let's get started so for now i didn't print out or cut out any circles to put in the back so but because i have a really small hole punch frankly i don't feel like wasting so much paper so I'm gonna use this tiny little paper that I have right here let me get my glue gun I'm gonna put something right there and I'm gonna grab this little hole that I have it's just like parts from this paper that I had left over just to cover the back you know of the <clears throat> staples that way you know what nobody could get hurt so I'm gonna do that let me move my gun this way of course I used the hole puncher that I just barely got um, my husband bought it for me at Hobby Lobby thought you know oh maybe you know we could find it cheaper at um at um, Michael's or at you know uh, Amazon because he likes shopping on Amazon but no we didn't find any deals, so we went with this. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to hole punch a couple, you know, like six of them. I'm going to make six of them for you guys right now. One, two, three, four, five, six. So let's just make one more just in case. So I could always save my scrap. Because you could always use them. I'll fix that later. So here's my little punches for the back of my rosettes. Okay. 
so I'm sorry if you guys could hear, but um, I got my boys at home, and I could hear them, but it's okay. So I'm going to be putting this wonderful rosette. It's on my paper print. Is this paper is like really, 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 really old. I mean, it's probably like 10 years old because I just I hoarded it, you know, thinking, oh, it's so pretty. It's for me. So let's put some glue. So, hope you guys' day is going better. There's going to be lots and lots of ladies putting pictures, you know, and videos. Not pictures, videos. This is all done through YouTube. You must have a YouTube channel. That was one of the requirements. And be able to share, you know, and everything. So, so I got this done. Very simple, easy, quick. And then I'm just going to add, boom, a flower. That's one of my embellishments in my rosette, which I love because I could put this in a card. I could put this on anything else that I want. So again, I know I'm supposed to be packaging them up and everything. I just don't know. How I'm gonna package them up if I want to do ten? I'm sorry, if I want to do two and two, or if I want to do three or four and four. So uh, we'll see. It was pretty good this weekend. Like I said, you know, we had a little nice dinner and nice dessert time, too. My older son decided to make a uh, fettuccine alfredo. And it was so delish. Okay, so my husband got me this butterflies down at um, Dollar Tree. And I really like them because they have music notes and lyrics on it and flowers. So I'm going to be using it with this one. And I love purple. So I'm gonna be using this. It's like a 3D. I'll be taking this in. I'm not gonna put it straight. I'm just gonna put it like kind of sideways, you know. And that's the second embellishment. <laughs> so, one thing I forgot to do is making sure I got extra glue sticks out so I won't have to be digging them. And by the way, uh, this is how I put my glue sticks. Yes, this is a tube from the washies. And it keeps them pretty good. All I did was put a little bit of tape on the bottom. That way the washies don't fall out. Or the tubes don't fall out through the little hole that it has. And so far, so good. Do, do, do. So, down at the bottom, when I'm done, I'm going to be putting up all the wonderful information of all these ladies that are doing this uh, collaboration with and check us out you know 
I mean, even if you don't, you're not participating with us for whatever reason, I believe we have a, um, there's a Facebook page that you could also look into. Um, and I'll put it down in the bottom that you could just come and share with us, you know, share like what you created, you know, uh, what's in your own mind, you know, hey, creativity, creative. Create what you want, you know. Share with us. L let us see what you do and and everything. I'm sorry since like I'm taking forever so my little flowers that I'm using are from the Dollar Tree too they're from Yacht you know the stickers I wanted to go with white and my husband's like oh but there's colorful ones I don't want colorful ones just bring me what I ask <laughs> Like I said, I really don't go much. I love to go look around and walk around, but it gets really hard. And I don't know. Now, these flowers, they move. So you guys could like pop them up. You know, make them different. So what do you think? Um, I'm thinking that maybe I'm going to be doing two in each package. I mean, they're pretty big. Or even doing three. Making two flowers. And two butterflies. I mean, what's your guys' opinion? So, if you guys... You know, help me out. I'll appreciate that. You know, how could I package this even better? Hey, y'all are gonna love it, like it, because y'all get to get some. <laughs> I'll be like, hey, go ahead and package it up, hook it up. But no. So, but again, I want to say thank you to Mandy, Mandy's place. She's the wonderful host. I've been doing. I've been doing um all this um swaps with her, and I've never had a problem with her. I done swaps with Tiffany from uh, Coffee Cakes and Crafting Facebook, and no issues whatsoever. Gone everything that I was supposed to get. So there we go. This is just some of my embellishments that I'm making for you guys. And I really do hope you guys enjoy it and like them. Um, I really like my flowers. My butterflies are like my favorite thing to have. Especially when they pop up. I was like, yes. So, to make this go nice, I was thinking of using um, paper pad that I got. It's not, it's a wildflower, you know, um, brand from uh, Michaels. And it's pretty nice. I like it. You know, it's really girly and really like, ugh, like peaceful. So I was thinking, oh, maybe I should use, you know, like this thingies and overlap them on another page so it could be hard because the paper's kind of flimsy. You know, it's not like thick, thick paper. Maybe I, I, I put this out, you know, and cut them out and just like put one right here. And in the back, I do another one. I don't know. So right now, I think. Therefore, I don't know what they say. 
I want something nice. This is a lot, a lot of paper. All right, it's ne it's like never ending pad, and it was like not even ten dollars. See, this ones are bigger, so it's like I got six. I got six exactly. I could put one and one, but I don't want to mess this up. That way, you guys could use it. But then I think I can make tags with those. So let's find a paper out of mine. How about this one, guys? This dotty one? This one seems nice. At least let's do one. Let's see how it comes out. Worst thing is worse. We don't like it. We change it, right? So, like I said, I'm not good with numbers. Not good with cutting. Like, you know, don't ask me, hey, you know, how many centimeters or how many inches did you cut that? Uh, I'm not good at all that. If it was up to me, I'll, I'll probably be cutting all this by hand. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just really bad with with math and all that. Sorry, guys. So a little bit, not bad. Trying to do good. So I got three different kinds. They look like I like sprayed them. So what do you guys think? One of each different stash. You think that's what I'm gonna do? So I just learned something cool with Mandy. Mandy says that we could take our dots and then we put them on the back not to take off. Like, yeah. So, we put it back here. And then what we're, I'm going to do is put glue on top of it. I'm not taking off the sticker, you know, the seal. That way it could stay there. And putting it down. I did the same with the other one. It's a little bit of glue. First one.
I know I ran out of big, big ones, but the little ones will do too. And this paper, I just save them for another one. Sorry guys, it's getting kind of hot in here. So this is what I'm going to be doing. And I was hoping to have received my bags, but I still haven't received any of my bags that I order. However, a bag is a bag. Would it fit? I may have to cut it down. Just put it here. It's two, two, two. So hold on. Open here the sandwich bag. See, I told you how flimsy the paper is. I may like fix that. I just want you guys to see the look. So mushy to the rescue. I just need a topper up here, huh? Nope. So. Okay, see, so I don't got dyes. And my hot house is way too hot to be turning on any machines. And I don't even have my oxygen tank on right now, which I should probably have it on. Who says you need a die cut? You can either use, you know, double-sided tape, whatever you wish. I am just going to do that. I'm going to take some of this cute washi washi. Oh, I haven't used this one. This one says, make a wish. And it's so bright and colorful, or should I use some of the other ones?
I got some new washi from the Dollar Tree, but guess what? It don't stick. I'm not liking it. So let's go look for something else. Yeah, I figure I'm just gonna use this one. The make a wish. Make a wish. Give it some color. So as you can see, this is how I will package mine up. I could make up to like, wow, like 12 sets. Hope you guys enjoyed it. So don't forget, go ahead and um, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, invite other people to come and look at us. So that way, you know, our stuff gets out there and people get to know us. Um, Yo, welcome, you know, check out the groups that we have, check out Mandy's place, you know, she's our hostess of the mostest, and now we're going to be doing um, other stuff, so here we go, and hopefully I'll see you guys next week on Monday again, same channel, bye!